that pretty much so sums up a New York City street. Beer cans, coffee, cigarette butts, masks, lotto tickets, McDonald's, and the acorns, and a lighter. <laughs> so I'm uh, just getting my fishing rod ready here. I'm actually picking up uh, Danielle. Uh, she had an art show. She'll be coming out with some art, so I'm picking that stuff up. But uh, over here in Long Island City, and uh, picking up art. There's some fishing piers, I think, down this road or that road. I don't know where I'm at. Um, you can see. Uh, real traffic y and whatnot. And there's going to be some big piers. So I'm just waiting a minute for her to come out. And then we're going to shoot down to uh, the fishing piers here in Long Island City, right in New York City, New York. And uh, see what we can get. Really nutsy out here, that's for sure. Not exactly my environment, but um, I'm going to see if there's anything out there. So I got this fishing rod ready and uh, don't know what's going on, don't know where I'm at, don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to put this knife away, forgot where I'm at. Um, <laughs> just cut in line with it. So, alright, I'm going to tie this knot, put my rod in the car, just waiting, so just killing time. And we'll see more. Just over here picking up the art before uh, we head down to the pier. Maybe people want to see. I don't even oh, know that you're an it's artist. Covered. It's covered mm -hmm. by oh, take it off quick. That's what you do. And where, 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 where can they find your art? Uh, DanielleCharetteArt.com. Oh, I'll put that down. <laughs> I don't know if anyone knows, but she's a magnificent artist, Danielle. We're about to head over to the pier now. We just came to pick this up. I'm out of my element here. Maybe till I get to my water. Thanks, Jerry. Yeah. If you want to show more, you can. Maybe later. Now we just got to catch some fish. <laughs> an adventure. Having an adventure. Yeah, I just got to catch one. Just got to catch one now. Oh yeah? Where? Oh, I don't know. I think maybe the by the pier, by the water. Here? Yeah. There. Here? Yeah, right down by the water. See what's there. Do you need oh, they, apartments, but oh, yeah. It's nice to know. Yeah, and right okay. down the block. Uh, I never fished there before, but I fish all over. Yeah. But, do you but know any, that fishing? Yeah, yeah oh yeah, you fishing. can. That would be good. Yeah, you could drop a line. All you need is a saltwater registry. You're from New York State or Yeah. Are you from New York State? No. New Jersey? Yeah, you get it online. Look up, go to the DEC. It's free. Like people that fish off of the water. I've never fished there, but I imagine they do. Yeah, about to find out. Mm -hmm. Those tall, skinny buildings are all new. Yeah. It's like the new design, I think. Even the skinny ones, they were never there. I just remember the Chrysler building. That's the only one that catches my eye. And that one, that one I think I remember. But those like tall skinny ones and the narrow ones, I guess they squeeze the building in wherever they can. Ooh, man, a big bass would be hanging right in there. They'll swim right in there. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, that's a challenge. <laughs> All right. Wow. Uh, from out here in Long Island City, over in Queens, New York City, New York, uh, on the pier, um, got the whole place, whole place to, to myself. It's like uh, once you get out on the water. It's all open. I got the whole table to myself. This is really neat. I like that. There's piers, but apparently this one, I think, is the only one it says you can fish on. And there's no one here. And uh, I think that's Roosevelt Island, no? Is that Roosevelt Island? It is, right? All right, I got three setups today. We got a Danielle's rod over here. I brought a pier fishing rods. 
and uh, I like using these on piers. Short, six and a half. That tip I repaired last night. Six and a half and six, six foot or so. Just going to be dropping straight down, a little flip casting, and uh, just getting set up. But uh, there's a couple conventional reels, spinning reel. I'm going to tie some hooks on, got some clam. We're going to start fishing here. So, right in Long Island City, New York. Never been here. Uh, the park guy said he'd never seen a guy catch a fish or a woman. So, we're going to see what we get. I'm not sure what's down there. So, I'm going to start with a small hook, bigger piece of bait on the hook. And uh, this way we get those little critters and those big critters coming to the bait and just want to see what's down there. So I'm going to go with a small hook. I always go to a small hook when I'm doing exploratory fishing uh, right here in Long Island City, New York. So that's a bridge there and uh, a lot of buildings. But when actually you're out here in the water, it's really more secluded than the beach. It's surprising. So I'm going to start with that small hook clams today. It's hot out actually. That's the scallop. I'll flip that into the water right down straight below. Just going to cut this up in the small medium pieces I think. It's a nice bass strip actually. Cut them. Now I'm going to start a little big, little big pieces. Just to see if we get a bite. If we start getting bites, then I'll modify the bait. Make it bigger or smaller. If we pull anything up, I don't know. Chum the water a little. I think it might still be coming in, so we got a good tide. I think I had a bite. Had a bite? It's, oh, wait. Oh, reel it in. I think one's biting. I saw the rod tip go. Bring it in slow. It's ready to go. Just wait for him. Oh! Oh! Sea bass! The sea bass. Yeah, maybe. I think they got to be 15 inches. I don't even know. Yeah. There's something there. There's a lot of bait in the water here. I had them over here. I thought I was stuck. Doing that. Huh? You got it? Wow. Good deal. I'm going to drop straight down here. I think there'll be one hanging. They're small. They're just getting bites. Let me show those little sea bass. I should, oh yeah. They're there. Oh wow, look at this one, Daniel. That's an oyster toadfish. You ever see one of them? Yeah, that's oyster toadfish. Let me get the pliers. Yeah, I think they're around there. Yeah, they like it here. They like it like uh, moving, swampy, 
water. They got good teeth too, you don't want to. Ooh. That is an oyster toadfish. Hmm. Looks like a frog, sounds like a frog. Today I'm just keeping it simple, just three-way rigging with a size four hook. This is 20 pound mono. I have mono straight up through here. That's a surgeon knot. You can do a dropper or whatever you want to do. Um, just keeping it simple. I got three ounces on, four ounces, two ounces, and uh, clam bait. Uh, just uh, nothing crazy, you know. Uh, I'm just enjoying the day. But I tell you what, it looks really bassy. I know if I lived around here, I'd be taking a fly rod out here at night. Um, it's just, I think anywhere you cast and at night, there'd be bass around. Um, it looks like a really nice place to fly fish. I'll show you a clam trip trick. Tenderize it for the fish. All the juices. Right? I hope not. Huh? It's moving? I'll see. I'll take a look for you. Be nice to get a big one, right? Oh, oh, there was one. Yeah. Maybe we'll see. Let's see if we can get him. He feels a little bigger. Oh, a big one. Oyster toadfish. Yeah, he's a little bigger than the other one. You can see why they call them toadfish, oyster toadfish. Yeah. The... They got teeth on them. Bad. He just wants to bite. Open. He does look like a frog. Yeah. There we go. I can get it. He just gotta. I don't. Know. Yeah, he gotta open his mouth for me. Come on, bud. Yeah, I did.
He's good. No blood. Oh, he went right to the bottom. And this is some really... No. Apparently he was like eating... Eating the worms. Yes, they are. A big snapper on there, huh? Huh? Yeah. He came chasing that right up. Wonder if we'll do it again. Let me see. And that that building down there, that's the Freedom Tower. That tall one? It's not? And that's what? The Williamsburg Bridge. Or is it? And I know that's the Empire State Building. Behind those two buildings, right? That's the Chrysler Building. Those are the only two that I know. Behind it, it's brand new. The, yeah, I see that. That's where the billionaires live. The ten year, the ten deniers, <laughs> the ten, the ten years live inside that way. That's the MetLife building back there. You know, that's the Chrysler Empire. Those are all the new ones. And that's the Queensboro Bridge. You said I know that's Roosevelt Island. And that's, this is Long Island City, all back in here. Really cooled down a lot. Is it really, these buildings are new too, really, right? This wasn't, this wasn't here 10, what, five years ago? Mm hmm I don't know. Huh. The millionaires live there. I live right over there underneath the pier. Crawl. <laughs> I'm saying I live underneath the pier over there. Oh yeah, that, that's there's someone out too. That's probably the gardener. <laughs> the owner probably never goes out there. <laughs> yeah, I see him. Yeah, we'll see. The little ones are fun too. Yeah. Right. What do we got here? Whoa, a fluke. Check that out. We got flounder, sea bass, and you see, check him out. Nice hook set. There he goes. Cool. We got fluke. Sea bass. Um. Oyster toad fish. What's this? All right, at least we didn't catch any bodies here in the East River, huh? <laughs> we can take a few more casts and then get out of here. Wow, that, you hit the other, you hit the bridge. I heard the ding. <laughs> but uh, Danielle, she's an artist, like I said, and I, her work, I, actually, I see it. It's almost like uh, old style. It has historical periods to it. You have to see it to see what I mean, but you can check it out. I put the link below it. And that's what, what what's the web the website just uh charretteart.com. I'll put the link on the bottom. So we picked that up, came down here, had oyster toadfish, sea bass, 
there was a lot of sea bass around. I was getting a lot of little hits and uh, that flew. But uh, I'm gonna fish a little long. Maybe we'll pull something out. But uh, thanks for watching. Those green dresses look wild. I wonder if they called each other up. <laughs> I'd be at Jones Beach. <laughs> oh, oh, I got a bite, I think. Or Breezy Point. Or the Mescoot. Yeah, I don't think it could be legal, but they're doing it. I knew something was going to happen. It's going to wrap into that other pier and burn it down. Oh, this is not good. Welcome to New York. Not good.